गाइस, आई एम भाई देदानी वेलकम टू माई चैनल एम फिट दिस इज माई फर्स्ट एवर वीडियो ऑन दिस चैनल आई एम नॉट अ सर्टिफाइड न्यूट्रिशनिस्ट और अ ट्रेनर बट आई हैव लॉस्ट ट्वेंटी के जीज विदाउट कंसल्टिंग एनी न्यूट्रिशनिस्ट और गोइंग टू एनी जिम सो आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर विद ऑल ऑफ यू गाइज वट एवर आई हैव लर्न थ्रू माई वेट लॉस जर्नी टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट फाइव वेट लॉस एनी सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट First enemy is not drinking enough water. Water is a magical drink when it comes to weight loss. People advise us to drink a lots of water when we are trying to lose weight. But what do we mean by lots of water? For some people it might be 6 glasses of water a day. For some people it might be 8 glasses. But how much water should we drink actually to lose weight? We should be drinking 0.033 liters of water for 1 kg of our body weight per day. Means if you are a 65 uh, kg person, you should be drinking 2.145 liters of water per day. And for every cup of coffee or tea you drink, you should have an extra glass of water as caffeine uh, dehydrates you. Drinking enough water will help you boost your metabolism, detox your system, and suppress your appetite. Also, drinking enough water makes your body stop retaining that extra water. so that you uh, lose your water weight what's the right time to drink water you should drink water after you wake up as it will help your body to activate your internal system you should drink water 30 minutes before your meal and after an hour of your meal as uh, drinking water right after you finish your meal will dilute your digestive juices and uh, will mess up with your digestion and uh, so that drinking water before bath helps you lower your uh, blood pressure so calculate how much water do you need to drink to lose weight and keep yourself hydrated and lose weight our next enemy is insufficient sleep nowadays we don't have time to sleep we hardly sleep for 5 6 hours or even less than that do you know that insufficient sleep is affecting your weight Sleeping for less than 6 hours can uh, make you 25% hungrier. Sleeping just 6 hours can itself result in 6 kgs of extra weight a year. Lack of sleep increases the secretion of hormone ghrelin which increases our appetite and reduces the secretion of hormone leptin. Hormone leptin uh, helps us to reduce our appetite and thus consume fewer calories. Less sleep can also cause low energy levels during daytime and promote inactivity. So it is recommended to sleep for 7 to 8 hours to be healthy. Our next enemy is crash diet. Crash diets are the one which include less than 1200 calories per day. They are not at all recommended when you are trying to lose weight because they are not a healthy way to lose weight. Uh, crash dieting uh, lowers down your metabolism. There are many side effects of uh, crash dieting including uh, short term weight loss, dehydration, nutritional deprivation leading to long term health complications and many more. It cuts on healthy fats and your lost weight is your water weight. It is very harmful at as protein and water are the first nutrients which are lost which makes us feel weak and uh, tired. So instead of going for a crash diet, we should uh, follow a sustainable healthy diet plan which is balanced in all the macronutrients. It will help us lose weight in a healthier way. So uh, ditch your crash diets and go for a sustainable diet plan. Our next and worst enemy is sugar. Sugar is a carbohydrate which will eventually turn into fat in the body. Sugar affects insulin resistance and blood sugar levels. Consumption of sugar spikes up your hunger levels which will cause you crave more for sugary foods. This molecule is not a natural part of metabolism and humans do not produce it. In fact, very few cells in the body can make use of it except liver cells. When we eat lots of sugar, most of the fructose gets metabolized by liver where it gets turned into fat which is then secreted into blood. Cutting sugar from your diet helps you consume fewer calories and thus lose weight. Sugary drinks and sodas particularly contain a high amount of calories. 
calories coming from sugar and consuming more calories than what you burn will obviously lead to weight gain and the worst thing about uh, calories coming from sugar is that they are empty calories which means that they don't provide you with any kind of nutrition so uh, reduce your sugar intake by replacing it with healthier alternatives like honey stevia or jaggery next and very common enemy is sedentary lifestyle the worst thing you can do to your body is not doing anything at all it's not too exaggerating to say that the sitting is mere smoking sedentary lifestyle is a type of lifestyle which involves very little or no physical activity at all the side effects of a uh, sedentary lifestyle are feeling nervous restless hopeless or even tired Watching TV or playing games on your phone or laptop can increase risk for anxiety. Sedentary behavior significantly increases your risk for several types of cancer. Sedentary adults are more likely to have sugar levels at 5.7% or above, which is high enough to be considered pre-diabetic. Sitting for too long can cause backache. Even if you have a very busy lifestyle, you should take out some time for physical activities like walking, running, or dancing. Being physically active is very important as it makes your body fit and your mind very healthy. These were our five weight loss enemies. Throw them out of your life and get ready to lose weight. If you like this video, please give it a big fat thumbs up and please let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe.